Hello, hi, Katie. We're going to draw a Honu. So here's my green sea turtle that I drew, inspired by this picture. Let's get started so you can make your own. I'm going to show you how to draw a Honu today. But anytime we look at something and draw it, we are practicing finding the lines and shapes that make up that thing. And if you get good at that, if you practice that, you can look at anything and then draw it. So the first thing I notice about the Honu is this big shape here. It's like a big teardrop on its side. And so I'm going to draw that right here. I see that it's round. And then it's pointy. So I've got this teardrop on its side. Do you see how I'm drawing lightly? That helps me sketch out the shape. It might not be perfect, the first lines I put down. And so I can keep improving it as I go. Now, the next thing I notice is that the shell here has a curve. We've got the top of the shell and then we've got the bottom part. So if I have this big teardrop, I can see that, ah, there's another curve inside of that. So I see if I start right about here, I can curve down and I've got the shell and then the bottom part, the belly. And so that is how I'm starting there. The next part I'm gonna notice is that while the shell has some beautiful designs, I'll do it later, the fins and the head all come out from underneath the shell. I'm gonna to get to the head in a moment. I'm gonna do the fins first. The first fin comes out from right here. And I see it goes out and then it becomes shape going down like this and like that to a point. I'm going to make it curved and go like that. And then down here, I've got this shape coming out, going down this. Now I've got the head. The head is looking this way. It's coming out the body here. I'm going to do an oval that is pointing in the way it's looking. And if yours comes out a little differently than me, than mine, your honu is probably just swimming in a different way. I've seen lots of honu and they all look just a little bit differently, just like people. So I've got that part there and I'm going to see the head is near the front in the middle. So about as middle up and same amount that way, I'm going to do a little almond shape and then the pupil. Sometimes they've got eyelids that make them kind of sleepy looking, but you can put that in or not. And then the mouth starts down here. And I find turtle mouths, they're kind of good to be, from there go up, down, up. And if you want the mouth open, do another line that comes up to it like that. So now I have that. Now, in this picture, we can't see the other fins, but if we were to, if this Honu was to swim just a little bit more, we would see another fin coming out right here. It is behind. So you can decide if you want to put this other fin in or not. And maybe you can see a little bit of the other fin or the tail. That's up to you. Now, it looks like I'm drawing really quickly here, but actually I just sped the film up. And that's because I spent quite a while looking closely at the photo and at my drawing and seeing what else I noticed. Like right there, I'm adding the scutes, the parts of the 
turtle's shell that have those beautiful shapes on them and I'm noticing where else can I make the shapes clearer and a little bit of erasing. I didn't use an eraser until just then but now I'm tuning everything I see to make it more and more the way I choose to make it. And here's another one that I did. Here you see I just have the two fins but now I'm adding some shading to this one so you've got the value making it look 3D. How is yours going to turn out? I can't wait to see it!